Hello and welcome to the Smart Reporting video session. This is Sachin from Smart Reporting team. In this tutorial, I am going to share some configuration or the best practices which are involved in the performance issue of Trust Smart Reporting. So as you all know, Smart Reporting hosted on the Tomcat server. It can be the bundled one or it can be the external Tomcat or the shared Tomcat one. So what happens when the smart reporting server went unresponsive or it may delay into some operations, report generation, report view, etc. So whenever say smart reporting application services or processes are consuming the memory higher than the allocated memory then of the Tomcat. So what will be the corrective measures in that case? So in case of Windows in Mail, so below the steps that you need to configure or follow to tune up, tune up the smart reporting Tomcat services. So stop the smart reporting services. Open a command prompt using a run as administrator option and navigate to the reporting installation directory and run the mention command, which is edit service, which is edit service smart reporting. After that, into the properties panel, you can add the below configuration as listed below. So these configuration basically helps to tune up this Tomcat garbage collection. So that will certainly help into reducing the performance hit onto the application level. Including this, you can also you, need, you also need to increase the initial memory pool and maximum memory pool to the values higher than the default values. So that if your application is heavily loaded or the application is being used by multiple users at the same time. So ideally, in case of any performance hit, you can use the below configuration as provided. Including this, you can also set the thread stack size other than the default value, which is 256 KB. So by applying this Java configuration onto the Tomcat, you will see and monitor the application behavior for a certain time and then eventually you will be able to see that the smart reporting application performance is performance hit is reduced for quite a bit so now in case of non windows platform there will be some change into the tomcat configuration so let's say for a linux environment First, you need to stop the smart reporting process or you can go ahead and figure out the Tomcat process ID and kill that process ID from the terminal. Then navigate to the smart reporting installation directory and edit the catalina.sh file. So this file actually has all the parameters to load into the Tomcat configuration. So once the suggested configuration is applied onto the files, you can enable the smart reporting info logs. So it will make sure that it will collect the, all the necessary information which needs to be looked out when there is a performance impact. So you can uh, go to the directory and edit the log property and enable the property logforge.category.com.hof to info. Then back up the existing log directory to make sure that we don't have any old logs and delete the existing ones. Then start the smart reporting services or processes and proceed to the application monitoring. So here we need to note that the tuning operation is necessarily iterative. That means you need to monitor, adjust, re-monitor, compare with the previous result and validate the improvements. So this is a standard process for runtime behavior adjustment. So in this way, you can very well monitor the performance issues and see whether the applied configuration helps into improvements of smart reporting behavior. Thank you for watching the video. Stay tuned.